Hey guys, how's it going and welcome to some Pokemon Light Platinum. I know I've done this before, but I did the DS version of this, which was kind of an incomplete thing that's been being worked that is basically being worked on. But this is the actual Game Boy uh, Light Platinum hack by Wesley FG in 2009. So let's get started with a new game of Pokemon Light Platinum by Wesley FG. This little background there that's going to be coming into view in a second as our professor also comes into view. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Jasmine, but people often call me Professor. This is a type of Pokemon. That is a Snivy if you didn't know. In this world, there are creatures called Pokemon. We humans and Pokemon live in harmony, some as partners in battles and others as friends. Not everyone thinks and acts this way, but studies have shown that Pokemon and humans can share a powerful bond. There are many new Pokemon to be discovered and cataloged and many secrets surrounding rare Pokemon that elude science. To unravel these mysteries, I've been doing research. You're... Are you a boy or a girl? And this is what the girl character looks like, just in case. But we are indeed a boy. All right, what's your name? We're gonna go ahead and set a new name. We are Jay. Uh, yeah, there we go. Did you gotta remember the controls real quick. J-O-S-E. Uh, where's the P? P. H. There we go. Joseph. It's Joseph? Indeed. Ah, okay. You're Joseph from Yellowtown. We're neighbors. Awesome. Now, now when you're... Oh, oh, jeez, man. Now is when your adventure begins. You will meet many friends and enemies, but you must have the courage to maintain your friendship with your Pokemon and continue to grow. Well, come over to my lab. I'll show you my research. Oh, this is, since it's a hack of, I think, Ruby and Sapphire, this is the moving truck that you're supposed to be in, but this is actually not a moving truck. Where is this place? Sounds like a dream. Or some kind of messed up world? What was that? Oh, do I actually have to walk up there? No, it's a cutscene. Oh, and here you see Palkia, Dialga, Giratina. And Arceus. Uh, it, it takes them a while to make their cries. Looks like Diago, Paul, and Giratina are doing something. Oh no! Hmm. Oh, that's a weird glitch right there in the left side where Palkia was. That's a weird graphical glitch there. <laughs> And I have no idea what they just did to Arceus, but, uh, okay. And flashes, flashes. I don't know what's going on. There's not much text. It's just, they're fighting. Hmm. Oh, and they all go for Arceus, and Arceus is gone. Palkia doesn't even land back on its thing. Little pedestal thing. I don't think Giratina's on it either, but whatever. Giratina can fly. I mean, they all kind of all can, but whatever. This is strange. I've got to be having a nightmare. And of course, we're here in our bed. A few things we're gonna do first is we're gonna. I can't check the PC. Guess that wasn't a thing. I think we have to set our clock though. Hi, Joseph. I'm glad you woke up. I was waiting to give you a message from Professor Jasmine. 
She's asking if you'll go to Central City. Something strange is happening there involving Alpha, the language only you know because your father taught it to you before you disappeared. Okay, Mom. There's one more thing. The clock stopped working and I forgot the time. Ah. Well, for me, it is... Uh... Oh, jeez. Nope. Yeah, we're going the right way. And... There we go. Yes. <clears throat> Thanks. Remember to go to Central City to meet Professor Jasmine. She's very helpful to everyone. Yes, I'm on my way now. See you later. If you need me, I'll be downstairs. Alrighty, Mom. So yeah, it's 10.35 a.m. pretty much. And we're gonna leave. Because we need to go... Oh, what's this? Ho! Oh, wow. Hello, friend. Is this Joseph's house? Yes, that's me. Good. Professor Jasmine asked me to come to get you because she urgently needs your help in Central City. I was on my way just now. I almost forgot to introduce myself. I'm Kauri. Kauri? Yes, the current champion of the Zeri League. I'm a close friend of Professor Jasmine's, and she asked me and a few of my friends to urgently look into this great mystery. She thinks it may be linked to the world's creation. Very interesting. Let's get there as fast as we can. Salamence will take us there right now. Salamence, use fly. And off we go. And cool cutscene with Salamence flying us across the cloud, over the clouds. Over to Central City. We just come out the Pokemon Center because whatever. Joseph, they must be close to the lake in the center of the city. Let's go. Now, I have no idea if Kari is male or female. I might have known before, but I completely forgot. So, uh, yeah, I might have differing voices for him or her later on. Hello, Joseph. I asked for help from Ash Ketchum and Kauri for this study because it's very hazardous. If something goes wrong, everyone on this planet would be in danger. I'll be careful, Professor. Hi, I'm the current world champion of the Pokemon League, and Kauri is a champion of Zeri. I already know who you and Kauri are. I've seen you on TV all my life. Yes, pretty, <laughs> pretty much with Ash. Okay, Joseph. I called you here to decipher these ancient inscriptions written in the Alpha language. No, I guess I'm just reading this. Wow. These inscriptions talk about the creation of the universe. It was made by Arceus who created the other Pokemon along with the rest of existence. But it seems that the balance of his power will gradually be broken and the world will pass through times difficult and dangerous for humanity. And everyone's just like, what? Every... It really is important scripture that must be destroyed before evil forces discover its power. Okay, Professor, I will destroy this old document now. Empoleon, I choose you! Love that Pokemon. Just love it. Empoleon, use Hydro Pump to destroy these writings now! And then, pshoo. Empoleon, use Rain Dance! And just, you know, because it's a little lake in the middle, so you gotta cover it up. And I like this animation. It's like it's gradually being filled up, and then that happens. Okay, good job. Return, Empoleon. Professor, now I have to deal with the Zeri League's issues. Ash and Joseph, I bid you farewell. Salamence, use fly. I'll go now, too. Goodbye, Professor. If there are any problems, let me know immediately. Now, I know that's not... <laughs> that's most definitely not Ash's voice, but... I gotta give him something different. Ho! Oh, this guy just... I don't know if he was always there, but he just... For me, he just appeared out of nowhere. Well, well, Professor. I was waiting for those two strong trainers to go away so that I could force you to give me the secrets of the universe's creation. You'll never learn it. Prepare to face the fury of Team Steam. Go, Poochiana! The fury of a Poochiana. Hey, Joseph. Take a Pokeball from my bag and use it to fight Team Steam. Quickly, Joseph, get one of those Pokeballs. Let's see, we have Charmander, Bulbasaur, and Squirtle that we can choose from. And I'm going to go ahead and choose... Huh, who do we want? Do we want to... I'm going to go for Charmander right here. And yes, we are going to go ahead and choose this Pokemon. Choosing Charmander because Charmander is a uh, ends up being a Fire Flying, which could come in handy. Um, the other... Well, Bulbasaur is a uh, Grass Poison, but whatever. So this Poochiana is a level 2 Poochiana. So there is nothing, nothing too hard about this. We're going to go ahead and scratch and take out this Poochiana. And we should pretty much be good. 
There we go. Took down the Puchiana. Wasn't too hard, and we gained 15 experience. Was not even close to enough for the next level. Well, Professor, this time you were lucky, but next time I'll kidnap you, and from this point on, Joseph is on Team Steam's hit list. All right, walk away. Yeah, you're not even running. Look at that. Can't even. Oof. Can't even take out on a newbie train. I haven't. That was my first Pokemon, and you couldn't take me down. How do you have a level two? Come on, man. Thank you very much, but now Team Steam will be after you, so I'll give you this Pokemon to protect yourself. Take care and train hard to challenge the Zeri League, and always be ready to fight Team Steam. Thank you so much, Professor, for my first Pokemon. I got a Charmander. Do you want to give your new Pokemon a nickname? Um, I don't necessarily have a nickname right now, so I'm not going to give it a nickname. Okay, Joseph, let's go back to my lab in Yellowtown. Alright, let's go. It was like the first time we got to control our character for like five steps there. Hi, Joseph. Welcome to my lab. Thanks, Professor. I'm ready to help you now. Okay, now that you have your first Pokemon, I think you should train to become a Pokemon Master by challenging the Zeri League and its eight gyms. Yes, I've dreamed of this all my life and now I'll make my dreams come true. Right, but first, I have one last request of you. To the east of Central City lies Marfini Lake. Professor Oak is at the lake and I urgently need to speak with him. Can I ask you to get him to contact me? Okay, I'll go right away. All right, so I'm gonna talk to these guys because I maybe they'll give me something. Mm, doesn't seem like it. He's talking about something about the Pokemon world and Arceus. Pokemon always have some mystery to be solved and the best scientists in the world try to unravel them, I guess. I think that's what he said. All right. So I think, actually no, there are a few more things we can do here. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, Go up here because there's an Elekid that we can grab up here. This Pokeball seems to have a Pokemon inside. Want to take the Elekid? Indeed. Now we have two Pokemon. I don't think this was in the DS version. I remember I I think I tried to get it, but I couldn't. Uh, it wasn't here. Or it didn't let me go upstairs or something. Something like that. Professor Jasmine's laboratory is one of the best research centers in the whole Zeri region. I would believe that. Oh, come on. Arceus is a legendary Pokemon that can change its type to anything, but that's only a theory because no one's seen it. Check out what's in this house as well. Pokemon equipped with Quick Claw attack first more than more often than others without the item, so you can use it to win many battles. Hmm. Someone here gives me the Quick Claw. Here in my home, I'm always responsible for our food, so I try to please us all. I love grass type Pokemon. They're always strong and cute, ready for any battle. Hmm. He told me about the Quick Claw, but it doesn't seem like he gave it to me or anything. Hey, you look like a good trainer. Take this gift for your journey. And she gives us the Max Potion. Whoa. Was not expecting that. Talk to that little girl if you want a Max Potion. Whew, damn. Some Pokemon only evolve with the help of items like Evolutionary Stones. Take one so you can evolve any Pokemon that you want. And we got a Thunderstone, so if you need a Thunderstone, talk to this guy. Alright, this is a Thunderstone. It's used to evolve certain electric Pokemon. There's a show about Pokemon on TV. I learned that fire Pokemon are strong against grass types, but have a weakness to water types, which in turn have a weakness to grass. Well, my friend, you should have known that already. And if you didn't, well, I guess you just learned it. In Yellowtown, people always want their children to be good trainers. Who will be pr who the pride of their families and of the city. Well, I got you. Now that is a very cool smoke thing right here. Wow. Today's technology is incredible. I can trade Pokemon with people around the world. Cool. And there's a nice little Starlies, you know, on the roost and stuff. And on the next episode, guys, we're going to continue on into the first route and get started with our journey. But for now, that is going to be it. I hope you guys like this and... I hope you're going to love this series because I do like like Platinum. I've done this before, and it's an amazing game. Um, and if you want to download it, go ahead. I'll probably try to leave a link in the description um, for where you can go ahead and download it. And I'll see you guys on...